Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Greg Marshall, and today I want to talk about taking back control of your time. So a challenge that I do know a lot of people run into is kind of feeling like they always need to respond to text messages or notifications on their phone or apps. And then what ends up happening is you feel like you're kind of, you know, quote unquote on all day long and you never get an opportunity to rest. And so what I want to go ahead and give you a tip on is number one, define the hours that you essentially really want to be on so that you can try to fit everything that you're trying to get done within those hours. So you have the option to take the outside hours off. So for example, most people don't really define the time frame that they would like to be finished with responding to emails or responding to clients or working on projects. And I think it's very important to set an end time so it gives you a goal to go ahead and shoot for so that you're not like always on the move and always on the go and feeling like you're working 24 seven. And this goes for anything between job, running your own business or schooling. So by setting a timeline or pretty much an end time to things ending, what you'll end up finding out is you will be more efficient with your day because you're actually working on things to help you get to the end goal and you know there's a time that you should be done. The danger in not defining the time frames that you would like to be on is it's very easy to kind of go overboard and do too much and next thing you know it, you're either working too much, you're doing too much for uh, maybe for schooling, maybe you're not being efficient enough and a lot of time is being wasted. So hopefully you like this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, do all that and uh, talk to you guys later.